sin. You deter from your sin. You're so worried about me. But even if I was the most wicked man in the world, that doesn't help you any. The best you could hope for is we're both going to hell. I'm not going to hell. No, you're going to hell. You're living wicked. Don't go to hell. I'm not going to hell. Why are you not going to hell? It's a bowling pin. Bowling pin? I guess he got knocked down one too many times. He repented and went home. He's carrying the shell of the old man away. Hey, the preaching of the cross is foolishness to them that perish. But to them that are saved, then the saved is the power of God. Oh my God, look what you started. Oh my God. No. Oh no. Right. You said you was a Christian. You no, you're, 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 you're a wicked man. You're going to bust hell wide open, man. I'm not going to. You're going to bust it. Yes, you are. In the state you're in, you're, you're in the fast track to hell. Yes, I'm judging you by your fruit. Your fruit's rotten, young man. Your fruit's rotten. Listen, out of the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaks. If, if you had a heart after Christ, you would speak the things of God. But since you have a wicked heart, you speak wicked things out of your mouth. You're, you're, man, you're, your own mouth condemns you. Your own mouth condemns you. It's all fun and games, man. Until you bust their heart open, man. You need to get right to God. Are you a preacher? Yes, I'm a You are a licensed preacher. You're a licensed preacher. Do I have to be? Do I have to go to a cemetery to be a preacher? No, but you have to be. No, I'm a Holy Ghost filled believer. I'm a Bible filled believer. Are you with your cigarettes? Are you a, are you a, are you a preacher? I, by the power vested in me, I ordain you a preacher. I'm ordained. This preacher ordained me. I'm good to go. I hereby ordain Jake as a preacher. I don't seek approval from cigarette smoking sinners. I don't, I don't need you to confirm my ordination. You know, if you're a Christian, you are a preacher. It is your duty to preach the gospel to me. You don't have to stand on a corner and preach. But it's your duty to spread the gospel to every creature. We're all ministers if we're, if we're Christians. You're judging. Uh, you're, you're just judging me, aren't you? Great. You're just judging me. Are you judging me, judging people? You got a tattoo. No, see, you judge me for judging people. So that makes that makes me judgmental, and that makes you a judgmental hypocrite by your own faith. Judge me. But the thing is, the only people. The only people that worry about judgment are guilty people. I'm prepared to be judged by God. I'm willing to be judged by God, judged by the way of God. The only people that are worried about getting judged are guilty people. And if you think, if you think my judgment is bad, then my grandmother will die and she would probably shoot you. If you little sissies, well then she's wicked then if she would shoot me. Well, that's wicked. But if you sissies can't take my judgment, wait till you stand before an almighty. God. You said, you said you what? Wait till you stand before an almighty God. God. You said if we if, hey, I, if we what? Like? If I what? If you can't take my judgment. You say sissies or sinners? I said I sissies said. and sinners and sinners too. If you can't take my judgment, wait till you stand no, before no. an almighty God. Hey, what is that? Is that a sinner over there? Because I would rather wouldn't cast any of you into hell. Hold because on. I'm not a holy and just judge oh, as God. I'll answer. Jesus said, judge righteous judgment. He said, don't judge my appearance, judge righteous judgment. 2 Corinthians 2.15 says, it says, he that is spiritual judge of all things. And also, he who lives without sin, can, can you cast him stone? But can you cast him stone? But can you cast him stone? But can you cast him stone? Listen, if y'all want to question, I can only take one sinner at a time. Can you, can you, I can't cast this out. Yeah, you're a sinner. You're just puffing on a sinner. Can you cast him stone? Uh, no. He who lives without sin, 
get your cash for Can you cash any stones? Have you seen any stones for Can you cash one? I'm a cash for you. Can you cash one? Don't touch me. Look at you. You're a modest woman, and you're talking to me about love. Look, that's loving. You can't tell me about love. You don't love God. If you love God, you keep us commandments. But like I was saying, why you come over here? Because they're complaining about uh, my judgment. Okay, and they don't give you the right to call nobody no sis. You don't, you don't, you don't mind the people cussing me and putting me off. You're worried about me saying sissy. Yeah, you damn straight. Because most of my family is like this. Why don't you fuck with you? Like what? Call somebody no sis. Like what? Don't gay? I yeah. wasn't even talking about gay. Okay, I was talking about the street man. You just be crying about me judging them. So why you come but hey, either way. The Bible says, 1 Corinthians 6, verses 9 and 10, no, no idolaters, no murderers, no fornicators, no homosexuals, no drunkards will inherit the kingdom of God. No unrighteousness will inherit the kingdom of God. It doesn't matter if your family is, it doesn't matter if you are, it doesn't change the way God views anything. God's not concerned with who is what. God doesn't care. It doesn't change the word of God. Yeah. 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 Calling out their names. What do you mean? Calling them. What do you mean? Calling them their names. No, let us laugh. I don't understand what you said. Well, what's the question again? If you're a so-called preacher, why the fuck you calling people out of Why are you cursing me? Because I can't. Are you a Christian? Why? I'm that's, just asking. I mean, it's kind of a tour. I know you're not, but it's a rhetorical question. I'm out here to preach the gospel. You ain't preaching the gospel. I will call people out of their sin. I'm preaching If I see a sin, I will call them out on it. Call if I see a sin, call yourself out. Call yourself out. Call what? What about what sin have I committed? You said him talking about people, so call yourself out. What I mean, what sin have I committed? I'm asking you. Call yourself out. Oh, judge. Call yourself out. 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 I'm here. I'm here to preach. The, uh, let me call myself out. I'm here as a preacher of righteousness. You're not a preacher. You're not a preacher. To turn from your sins. You're not a preacher. Turn from your sins and turn to Jesus Christ. Because, folks, if you die in your sins, you're going to bust hell wide right open. No, nigga, you won't bust hell wide open. God says the unrighteous will not inherit the kingdom of God. No sin will stand before God. You need to turn. The Bible says you can give 99 times one. 99 you need to worry about God's It's where you're going to end. You see, there's a lot of hate in people's heart. There's hate in people's heart. That's why they get angry. That's why they want to get violent. Because they hate me. But guess what? They hated Jesus first. Jesus says, don't marvel if the world hates you. They hated me first. They hated me first. I'm not Jesus. You should, you should thank God when I'm not Jesus here today. Because when Jesus comes back, He's not coming back to hurt people. He's not coming back to save people. He's coming back to punish the wicked. He's going to burn this world. He's going to judge this world and righteousness. And most of you are not willing to God's You don't want to be put in the Everybody says only God can judge me. But you're not ready for God's judgment. Your answer is not ready for God's judgment. I know by your fine mouth. I know by the wickedness that I hear. I know by the hate that people so show to me. So I know by the hate that so people spew out to me. You mad or no? You mad or no? Am I mad? You mad or no? You heard me. No, I ain't mad. I'm not mad. You're mad. You're mad. You're mad. You're mad. If I was mad at you guys, if I hated you guys, I would just go home. I would say, go ahead. Go ahead and go to hell. But I love you. That's why I'm here. I can hate you from home. This is the... You guys haven't been loved like this before. You've got all that superficial, false love. You've never been loved. If you don't want my love, then kick rocks. Walk on. 
man. I'm not forcing you to stay. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not here making you stay. You choose to stay here. I'm standing on this street corner. I'm standing on this street corner. You can walk by or you can stay and hear the gospel. I suggest you stay and hear the gospel. I'm talking to everybody. I'm talking to everybody. To whom it may apply. If you don't, if you don't, if you don't want the word of God, then you can walk on. I'm not going to force it down your throat. I'm not going to make you stay here. Why do you got so much hate in your heart? Why do you hate me like that? I want to come in. I, I feel like you're hating. I feel like you're hating. I want to come in. I want to talk about you. I feel hate. I feel hate. I'm not, actually, I'm not talking to you anymore. So you, I've, shaked, I've shaked the dust off my feet. I'm not reaching him. Let her get him. Let me let him get him. What's your name? I'm not talking what? I'm, I'm only talking to people that have ears to hear. Yes, I see you Move over here. Move over here. Move over here. If you've got ears to hear, then listen up. God would that none should perish, but then all should have everlasting life. But guess what, folks? Most of you are condemned already. You know what? You're living in sin. You're walking on your way to hell right now. So God is the road. Where I say something, many I believe in Jesus. I have a cigarette, you need to pour it. Destroy my cigarette. Stop worrying about people's cigarettes and you're going to smoke a bunch. Maybe you'll feel bad. Let's some meat for a minute. Yeah, you can say all you want. Listen, folks. You can talk to me. I'm not talking to you. Bring your own microphone. Bring your own microphone. I see the hole. Here's the hole. I can't lose it. I believe. Most people. So hold on, hold on. Wait, if it's a piece of destruction, you have to be a piece of destruction. In the word of God. Okay, you have to, they don't want you. I have a question. I, I want to rip this in half. But I, I have a question. I have a question. Just because I said it doesn't make sense. Right I want to rip it. I want to rip it. But I have a question. And I need an answer. That it looks What's your like question? Wrong. My question is Does Jesus hate sin or did he die for sin? That's it. Oh. Yeah. What does he hate? Are you familiar with Psalms 5? Turn that around. Turn that around. Turn that around. Turn that around. Jesus Jesus equals hate Psalms 5.5 says, no, he Jesus hates sin. Jesus hates sin. Jesus hates sin. The Bible says, God hates sin. Have you seen it? 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 Your mama jumped off his breath. Have you seen it? Yeah, you want a light. Wicked sinners. Wicked sinners. I want your wicked heart. Hey, the smoke of your torment is going to ascend forever. In a little bit, let's just turn it off. Let this crowd, let this crowd I'm not saying Jesus approves of this. In fact, let me give you seven things to say. Jesus doesn't want to These six things to say. Jesus doesn't want to say. seven are an abomination to him. Is that a sin? A proud look. Is that a sin? A lying tongue. Hands that shed innocent blood. Heart that devises wicked imagination. Feet that be swift to running to mischief. I'm quite sure it takes me A false witness that speaketh lies. I'm quite sure it takes me to be a Everybody, among the birds. Everybody, I'm going to ask a question. There are things that God hates. I want to hear his answer. No, you don't want to hear my answer. That's why I'm not taking questions. Oh, why are you here? Because you won't shut up for five seconds. Shut up. You don't tell anybody to shut up. I'm not taking your question. I'm not taking your question. You better watch your mouth. I'm going to ask a question. I'm going to ask a question. You can ask all you want. I'm not going to answer your question. What? He can't answer your question. The thing is, he doesn't know the Bible like that. You can justify your sins. You can find whatever excuse for that day of judgment. You're going to be broken and naked before God with no excuse. Nobody's going to stand. Nobody's going to stand. You're going to stand before God by yourself and answer for your sins. That's why today is the day of salvation. You all need to turn from your sins. You all need to turn from your sins and trust in Jesus Christ. If you haven't turned from your sins, you're not saved. If you're still living in your sins, then you haven't had victory over your sins. You haven't had the shed blood of Jesus, the Savior of your sins. You can justify whatever sins. Can I ask you one more question? Jake, let's